This video is brought to you by Squarespace. Hi, we're Steven, Jess and Hunter, a little family who spent four months turning an empty cargo van into our home with the goal of circumnavigating Australia. We left from Perth in June 2020 and these are some of the highlights of our big lap so far. From camping on the beach to swimming with humpback whales, Hunter taking her very first steps amongst the red dirt of the Aussie outback, to then swimming in some of the most beautiful crystal clear waters of the Great Barrier Reef, and honestly, about a million memories in between. Then in November, the international borders to Australia opened after being closed for two years, and there were some close friends who needed to meet our little baby. So we said goodbye to Cooper, and three months later, we are finally heading back to see him. All right, after three months, there Cooper is. I am so excited to see him again. If you guys are wondering what we did, we found like a tourist park, just parked him here. It was like, I swear, a hundred bucks a month to just park him in here. Oh, it feels so good to be back in the van. Let's just make sure after three months, Cooper's still working. All right. It's uh, definitely a bit of a tight squeeze to get in here. Let's jump in. And I feel like he's a bit of a mess because I remember last time we left him in a mess. <laughs> Not as dirty as I remember. Hey, Scoops. <laughs> I think someone's going to be excited to see you. Okay, I know I should probably be checking if the engine is working, but let's just see if the lights. Hey, 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 inverter, still working. Pretty good so far. Somehow left some water in the tank. And surprisingly, <laughs> I don't know why I'm surprised about Cooper, 95% left on the battery. So the solar must've been kicking in throughout, which is kind of cool to know. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> what is this? <laughs> is this a banana that looks like it's turned into a pepper? <laughs> if anybody was wondering what leaving a banana in a fridge for three months looks like, that is disgusting. Back in the driver's seat, let's test if after all this time, battery's dying. Let's see if this is going to be a nice smooth exit, but we're going to have to uh, do a bit of work. All right, come on, Cooper. Please start. <laughs> he works. Let's go share the excitement with Jess and Hunter. I'm sure they are dying <laughs> to see Cooper again. Hunter might not remember, but I'm intrigued to see if she does. I can't keep this all to myself. Let's go pick up the girls and resume full-time bad life. Hunter, do you want to go see Cooper? No. You excited? I'm excited. I think Hunter's forgotten who Cooper is. Hunter, who's Cooper? Hmm. Where is he? Oh, Cooper. Do you remember him? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Hunter, you're going to be so... I'm excited just to see Hunter being reunited with all her toys and Scooby-Doo. Yes! Oh, Coops, he looks fine. Oh my gosh, he's like bigger than what I remembered. Coops! Oh my gosh, he's muddy. <laughs> Hunter? <laughs> he missed you! <laughs> Do you want to come in? Do you remember all your stuff? Yeah. What the? The big dog dog. It's dog dog. It's the big dog dog. <laughs> well, as they say, the welcome home. Dog. Yeah, welcome home. It's all working. My is it? are working. Fridge is working. Dog dog. No. Hunter, I've got a question for you. Are you ready to move back into the van full time? I do. You do? <laughs> okay, everybody is officially on board with the full time van life again. Okay, I think our first day back is going to be spent 
repacking Cooper, and he needs a major clean out. Do we have a shot of the last time she was in this car seat? She looks so big. I feel like we need to like readjust it now, Hunter. You're such a big girl now. <laughs> so now what? <laughs> That's a very good question. <laughs> Haven't planned anything up to this point. So now we're in the van. Where do we go? Australia's our oyster. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we need to do some planning. When was the last time we, we did go? a three hour drive? <laughs> we'll just drive to we Maybe we can just drive for like an hour or two. And then Stop we'll stop enough. and spend the afternoon cleaning, do grocery shop. It felt so good being back in Cooper, hitting the road, even though we had no idea of a plan in hand. Alrighty, so we've been driving for a little bit now and <laughs> realised we've skipped breakfast. It's like 1.30 and we've stopped for a bit of a snack at probably the most Australian place you can stop at, a pie shop. And if you're not from Australia, we don't just do apple pie here or blueberry pie. We're talking savoury beef, potato, chicken, veggie, curry pies, everything. And it's so ingrained in our culture. You come here, you need to get yourself a pie. I am such a sucker for a spinach and feta sausage roll. Feels good to be back in Australia. Mm, it's good. Mm -hmm. So with an empty fridge besides a shriveled up banana pepper, it was probably worth us heading to Coles and doing a bit of a grocery shop. Do you want to go give these to mum? We uh, need to fill old Coops up. The petrol prices have definitely gone up a lot since we were last in him. Ouch. Welcome to Canberra, everybody. Setting up the van for the night is kind of like riding a bike. You just somehow remember how it all works. And tonight I th we should book a site where we have power, water, access to a washing machine just so we can just get on top of life a little bit. Alright, I think before we clean, we just need some space. We need to get everything out of here so we can just readjust our lives. <laughs> being back home. For the last three months we have been living out of a suitcase and it does feel quite nice being able to unpack and uh, move back into our much bigger suitcase. Guess what was next to the laundry? Pizza. Do you want some pizza? Pizza! Pizza! pizza. <laughs> Guess we ain't cooking tonight? I've decided we'll have a pizza. <laughs> Is it pizza? I did. Oh, let's see. Okay. okay. Pizza was a good idea. Oh. Pizza. 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 <laughs> I think this is going to be my favourite phase because Hunter is starting to learn to talk, trying to mimic us as much as possible and she's just saying words. I'm excited just to hear her different takes on everything. Pizza. Pizza? Pizza? Yeah. Yeah. It's like, what a crazy last few days. Yesterday we went to bed in New South Wales and today we're having pizza in ACT. <laughs> Three states in two days. 
was trying to clean the van. I was trying to look after this one. Mama. Oh, thank you. Me. I'm me. And <laughs> now it's Hunter's turn. Uh, and Daddy, she is? Daddy gets it. Where's Daddy's one? She's like, take the buzzle off. Daddy's one? I do. Yeah. And then should we oh, all cheers? Okay. One, two, three, cheers! To first night back in the van. Ooh. Hunter, everybody clap. Everybody sing. Bow to your partner. And then you turn around. Me. Oh, do you remember that time, Steve, when we first built the bed? And how exciting and fun it was? Yeah. Yeah, it's that. Oh, it, it feels just like it again. Just as tall. I'm lying. I was saying that the worst part about living in a van is build, making a bed. She's gonna test the bed, ready? Oh. What's that, Hunter? It's a bunny. Do you remember that bunny you used to cuddle it to sleep? Other. Did you want to go up, up in this bed? Other. Yeah, you do? Mama. Climb up. Mama. Mama, help? Yeah. Okay. Ready? Yeah. And go up. <laughs> and you come and lie your head here. Ma, no. <laughs> okay. Are we doing cubby houses? Yeah. Should we bring Scooby Doo into the cubby house? Oh, where's Scooby Doo? Huh? Quick. Get Scooby Doo, put him in. Mm. Here you go. Ready? Scooby Doo's in the cubby house. Say night night. Night night. Night night. Okay, go back under quick. Bye. So as we move back into the van, we just wanted to take a quick moment to thank our longtime friends and partners of the channel Squarespace for partnering up with us on this video. To be our new round here, Squarespace is the amazing all-in-one platform we can easily put together a website or blog. If you guys know, our blog, FlyingTheNest.tv, is built on Squarespace where we share all our family adventures. And if you're wanting more in-depth looks at how much things cost, go check out our blog. And if you're wanting to build your own blog, make sure you go and check out Squarespace. They've easy put together award-winning templates plus if you get stuck 24 7 customer support so if you are new want to check it out i have a link in the description to get a free trial plus 10 percent of your first purchase huh? <laughs> good morning guys <coughs> go <laughs> I forgot how comfy this mattress was. That was such a good first sleep. And some strawberry? Yeah. Mm -hmm. He's real life That's strawberry. Okay. Oh. And what is this? <laughs> I never thought I'd be saying this. We've made it to the capital of Australia. I think because Sydney is such a big city and it is so well known, a lot of people think that that is the capital city. But no, it is here in Canberra, located in the ACT, which stands for the Australian Capital Territory. And seeing as we've come all the way out here, we thought we may as well go and hit up some of the sites. <laughs> so the Capital Territory, not just known for Capitol Hill, there's actually some unique spots if you decide to leave the city. So we've just come to check out some falls and maybe go for a little afternoon dip. Definitely think Hunter is very excited to be back in the great outdoors. So we've made it to the top of Gibraltar Falls and it is so stunningly beautiful. There's this infinity pool which you can go for a dip and you have these insane views of the mountain ranges. Picture perfect. We wanted to go for a dip but I think because the rains that have been happening throughout New South Wales at the moment, yeah, might just save this one for another day. But still, totally worth coming out here. Just to even just enjoy the views. 
Oh, thank you. Can I have a cookie, please? Daddy, have one? Oh, thank you. Me, I do. And you have one. You get one for you. I feel like this is why we love doing van life so much, is that this morning we were like, let's go have a picnic somewhere, had a Google, found this spot, and now we're here and the views are incredible. We're currently sitting on the top of the falls, looking out at the bushland. Okay, I think before we can officially say we've moved into Cooper, there is still one thing we need to do. We've unpacked, and now it's time to celebrate. You know what it is? Mm -hmm. I'm hungry. Yes. <laughs> this is how we are celebrating. Ready? We're bringing out the bad boy, the big boy, the big gun. You've missed this, haven't you? Have we squeezed him in there now? We squeezed him in here, kind of. Come on. Here he comes. Air fryer time! <laughs> I now feel like we can officially start the next chapter of this road trip. So if you guys are new around here, hit subscribe and we will see you somewhere in the next episode. We need to work it out. <laughs> Thanks guys.